Hello and welcome to this travel video as we are making our way through the Amalfi Coast, beginning with the town of Salerno. Anyone visiting should first take a walk on the Riviera and take in the sight of the adventure to come. So we were talking to this fisherman on the docks and he told us that this piazza is brand new. Our journey started in Rome, where we took a fast train through Naples to Salerno. We then continue afterwards to Maiori, Minori, Amalfi, and Pompeii over the course of three days. But before we continue, let's take in the moment with the cappuccino and cornetto. Our reason for choosing Salerno is not only because of its location, but because of how it's overlooked as a center of pilgrimage. Welcome to the Cathedral of Salerno. This church, we're gonna take a look inside, it's absolutely beautiful. John Luca's already inside right now too, so we're gonna join him and take a look around. The Cathedral of Salerno was consecrated in the year 1084 by Pope Gregory VII, who was buried on the right side of the main altar. The present-day upper church was completed in the 17th century, after the original was destroyed in an earthquake. On the left side, we go down the stairs and into the crypt, which is from the original church. At the center is the main draw for pilgrims, the tomb of the apostle St. Matthew. St. Matthew's remains were brought to Salerno in the 10th century, at the time of the cathedral's construction. Before becoming one of Jesus' 12 apostles, Matthew served as a Roman tax collector in Galilee. This occupation was widely considered traitorous by his fellow Jews. The frescoes on the vaulted ceiling, painted by Barasario Carinzio in the Venetian style, portrays scenes from Matthew's Gospel, from the life of Christ to miracles and the call of sinners to conversion. The vaulted interior was designed by Domenico Fontana, who also served as one of the original architects of St. Peter's Basilica. From this experience as pilgrims, one can walk away with a sense of awe, peace, and personal connection to the life of this saint. I, I don't know how he's doing it, but somehow there's this giant bus going around all of these tiny roads, check it. I'm terrified that I'm going to die driving the bus like, la 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 la, 